Hey everyone, Raidron here. Welcome back to Let's Play FTL with the Osprey on hard mode. Did a really good job in Sector 1, so let's go ahead and uh, scoop out Sector 2. Oh, okay, so the quest that I didn't do in Sector 1 does not carry over, but there's plenty of nebula here, which is perfect. So I want to go 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. That would be ideal. Let's see if we can do that. You detect rebel scout with an attack approach on a small group of friendly outposts. Rebels are charged, but they're not firing. That's definitely intervene. Okay, burst lasers on their shields first. I love this song. Oh, we got boarded. Take him out. Take him out, Scott. Beat him up. Okay, good thing I have two shields. Haha. -ha. Oh, this ship can't hurt me then. This ship actually can't hurt me. And they don't have a med bay. So this is a ship I could have beaten by boarding. I could have sent my rock and my uh, mantis to board this ship and kill them. Because they don't have a med bay. So now I'm kind of regretting not getting the, uh, the crew teleporter. Alright, Scott almost died. That's fine. He's lived. Scott's combat should be leveling up soon. Oh, not really. Needs more battle experience. Alright, come back to the weapon, Scott. This is great. The ship can't actually hurt me. This is awesome. Can I suffocate this ship, potentially? No, they're gonna die. Oh, I missed! I guess I could potentially- Oh, uh, my artillery beam fired. Damn it! Oh, so one thing that's- um, No, I got extra scrap. Nice. One thing you gotta be really careful with the Osprey is because the artillery beam fires by itself, you need to make sure that if you have crew teleporters, you beam your guys off the enemy ship before your artillery beam fires and kills the ship on accident. Or you need to make sure that you turn off your artillery beam. Because it's very easy for the artillery beam to just kill the enemy ship while your crew's on board. Like, even if your weapons are offline, they will still just blast your ship, like, blast their ship up and then you will die. Yeah, let's send tell missiles for scrap. I definitely don't need missiles. Any stores? No. I have 90 scrap. I could upgrade my ship some more. No, let's just save it for now. So, this distress, then into the nebula, probably. I don't want to take too much time out here. I need more fuel, too. You look at a nearby human mining colony where an unknown disease has spread by ruin. Like they're setting up a quarantine to contain it, but a riot has broken out. Send the rock crew. Oh, apparently they're in immune and NG. Let's send down uh, John. With no fear of catching the disease, your NG crew member helps reassure and organize the infected humans. Calm by its blah, they give you rewards. Nice! Three fuel, that's huge. Yeah, let's get into the nebula quick. Oh man, if I go here, two, one, two, three, four, five. I feel like maybe I do have time for this. And I can do this, this, this. But when I supposed to go like. What was my plan originally? So I can't visit this spot no matter what. I'm gonna go here, here, here. Let's do it. You are immediately contacted by settlement. Hello, traveler. Ship seems to be offered for combat. Care to take off work? Yes. A space dock is currently on South of the Rebels. Although the dock is technologically illegal within the laws, or technically illegal within their laws, it's very important for our trade. We'll pay you in fuel and scrap if you promise to save them. Yeah, okay. Oh, there's a store. There's a store. But it means not going in the nebula. So I'm gonna go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. That's perfect. Let's do it. Into the plasma. It's worrying that rebels have penetrated those deep into uncharted space. Oh, mind control again. Why do they keep mind controlling Chris? It's fine, whatever. Chris, you can pound on the shields all you want, no matter. I gotta make sure my burst lasers fire. Oh god, missiles! Missed. So Chris almost has a layer of shields down, which is not good. Did I miss? No, it's heading for my artillery beam. Oh, it's offline. So, John, fix the artillery beam. Scott, go back to weapons. That's offline. Let's take out the weapons. Damn it! 
John Huffick shields. Actually, I'll go back to weapons. No, the weapons, got, they got a missile off. Okay, I missed. Whew. 14 scrap, very nice. Scott and Chris into the mid bay. John, repair the shields. Oh man, I really need another burst laser. Come on, fix it. Let's go. Store? Nope. Let's go here. Oh no, Ion Storm, damn it. You arrived in the middle of a plasma storm despite the hard conditions that's waiting for you. Okay, so. He has a burst laser. I have one engines and oxygen on. I cannot power my burst laser. Or my artillery beam. I can either drop a level of shields to power my bone burst laser and then engines off with the artillery beam. But engines drop me to zero. I don't think I want that. Or I can drop engines for artillery beam I keep my. It depends on how many shots this is. I think this is a three shot laser. I think I'm gonna go with this. I think this is my plan. Yeah. I wish I had one more power. Let's we'll see how many shots it fires. I think it's three. Yeah, it's gonna be three. That's fine. Okay, pilot offline. Fix it now. Fixed, back to engines. Alright, good. It's a good thing John can fix things so quickly. Take out the right weapons. Yes! Got them locked down. So now that the weapons are down, um, engine off, and artillery beam. If I can keep the weapons locked down right now, then it won't matter. Yes, good, 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 good. Scott. Keep powering those weapons up quickly. Very good. Alright, easy. I have this locked down. Very good. Good job, me. Oh, we're trying to escape? No, we will not allow that. Come on, come on, shoot faster. No, we do not accept surrender. Now the artillery beam will finish him off. Oh, maybe I should upgrade the artillery beam. I wonder if I need to put more power into it, actually. I don't remember if you need some more power as you upgrade. You might not. Alright. Let's uh, power this down. Points into engines. Let's jump. Alright, oh, this is outside the thing. Shields up, burst laser on. Let's go straight for. So you have a burst laser and a beam. This shit might not be able to hurt me. I'll, I'll wait. If this is a one shot laser or a two shot laser, then they can barely hurt me. I might just starve. I might suffocate them to death. We'll see. Oh, they can't hurt me. Alright. I'm just gonna go for the suffocation then. In which case, I don't want the artillery beam on. I might be able to kill the crew if they're all repairing the oxygen. I can just keep blasting it until they die. Um, Ken, I don't even need you to pilot because my shields can stop them. So I just heal up. Easy peasy. Damn it! Kill them! Kill them! I kind of wish I had uh, the boarding group, the boarding drone right now, because I'd be able to uh, board them and kill them, because they don't have a med bay again. So I would just slowly kill them ship, because they don't have the ability to heal. I can jump back, heal, fight, jump back, heal, fight. They offer you some of their cargo if you let them live. Nine scrap, two fuel, two missiles. No. I want the scrap right now. This is great! My ship is so good! Having two levels of shields by Sector 2 is really, really huge. Alright, didn't kill their crew, unfortunately. They almost got away. That would've been bad. 
All right, let's go to the quest and then down, 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 over, up. Uh, let's upgrade the ship. Mm, what do I want to upgrade? Let's see. The next level of shields is 150. I could almost do it. I could almost have level 3 shields. Let's do two of these and two of these. And then an artillery beam level. Let's do that. Oh, it actually requires more power. Man, that sucks. That sucks. That makes artillery beam sucky then. I thought artillery beam was really good. Apparently not. I just need one more burst laser on the ship and I'd be good. Once you arrive at the beacon, you detect Rebel Scout assaulting a compound on a nearby desolate moon. Yeah, it's interesting. Let's engage. So, I heard a drone sound. Do they have a drone? No? No drone? Okay. They have a single laser. Okay, so they can't hurt me either. Wait, they have a drone? Are, are they, are they going to board me? Is it like a boarding drone? What kind of ship is this? What kind of crappy ship is this? They can't hurt me. So we'll turn the artillery beam off since I don't want to kill them on accident. Let's try to suffocate them again. Suffocate slash kill their crew. As far as I could see, there was only one crew member on that ship. And we can kill him. We can kill him! On. We got one more shot, potentially. Potentially two more shots on it before we kill their ship. Come on, kill the crew. Oh, we got one more shot. Yes. Suffocate them. Oh, no. There's way more crew members. Just kidding. That's not going to work. Oh, well. GG. Oh, four hull points repaired for them, for me helping them. Oh, and there's a store! Oh, oh, what? Oh, automated reloader is good. Defense scrap prevents enemy drones from targeting any. Oh, prevents enemy defense drones from targeting anything. That's okay. Cloaking, mind control. Oh, I just bought stuff, so I don't have any money. I just upgraded my ship. I actually can't buy any of this. I can't even buy the automatic reloader, which I really want. Uh, drain control is okay. Cloaking is okay. Well, cloaking is really good, but I don't have it. I can't buy it. Mind control is not that good. And then I can't buy any of these. I can't even buy a person. Damn. Okay, I'm just gonna buy some fuel then. Let's buy all the fuel. Alright. Let's go back into the nebula, down, and then up to the exit. Oh, that was such a good such a good chance. Okay, so there's a mind control drone and it's trying to charge the FTL, so straight for the straight for that. Okay, so Chris, go stop him from being a douche. Straight into repairs. This. Okay, well, is that microphone gonna wear off? Chris, get the hell out of here. I'm going to power off that to the for heels. John, go repair engines. Okay, that's offline. Let's go for weapons next. Okay, I missed. Okay, let's go for the mind control next. Let's power the oxygen back on. Who did mind control? The engines? Okay, that's fine. NGs don't do that much damage, so it'll take forever for them to kill engines. Woo! That was that was pretty that was pretty tough. Scott, Ken, Chris into the mid bay. Let's power it on. Oh man. Some of these battles are actually pretty rough since I have such limited weapons. 
Alright, let's go. Oh, this isn't in the nebula. Oh, wait, is it? No, it is, it is. Good. Nope, nothing here. Alright, jump to the next one. A heavily damaged Federation ship is hiding in the nebula at the beacon. Before we have time to make the trade into nebula, let's attempt to follow them. Oh, if you have upgraded sensors, you can, like, guaranteed find them. Nope, can't find anything. Oh, a store? That's useless here. Damn it. It does absolutely nothing for me. Advanced FTL allows the ship to jump to any previously visited beacon. That's okay. Distraction buoys. Leaves a false signal sector to delay rebels one jump. Meh. Fire suppression. I only put fires throughout the ship. Meh. Flak breach and small bomb. Flak cannon. Eh, that's okay. Breach missiles. Meh, I don't really use missiles. I don't think for me to buy anyway, because I have no money. Heh, <laughs> Ohm. I have a friend named Ohm. Um, should I buy more fuel? Let's buy a couple more fuel. Alright, let's go to the exit. I might have time to go up and back down again, we'll see, I'm not sure. A small platform of Lord's Beacon looks like a fueling station, so it's surely blocking to do small prices and spectrum for Uh. The platform seems to have function come out at any moment. No, let's not. So, could I jump here and back? I think I could. I think I would make it. I could potentially go to a distress beacon and come back. Is it worth it? No, it's not worth it. <laughs> going to the next sector. Zoltan Homeworlds. I'm never going to Zoltan Homeworlds. Alright. Sector 2 done. Not as great as Sector 1, but came out pretty okay. So I'll see you guys later on in Sector 3. Take care, everyone.